Hi guys, my name is Green Eyed Gemskull and welcome to the Sims Free Play Day Spa update. I have just updated my game. As you can see, and we get this screen update in progress when you first go into the game. This update came out at midnight on the 3rd of May, Tuesday the 3rd of May, we can get this update from. And when you go into your town, yes, you'll get this pop-up here. So new, oh, new global community events. This looks like, it's like the romance update we had with the tropical island community event. I was expecting a quest, we haven't got one. The Simtown Health Spa, 12 days this is. Everything you need to design your own health spa, including saunas, massage tables and more. Collect gems to unlock new items and choose the ones you want. Let's just click on start collecting. So if you are watching this video after the 12 days have finished from the 3rd of May, this event has now finished and you won't be able to take part. Sometimes they bring these types of things back, but we'll just have to wait and see if they ever bring this back. So the first thing you need to do is to place a quartz deposit. You progress in the Simtown Health Spa global community event by collecting items, by collecting gems. You'll need a gem deposit for that. Go to the event items tab of the home store and place a quartz deposit in a home lot. So in your home store you'll have an event items and what do we need to place? A quartz deposit. So we can take four of them. I'll just use this lot that we're on here. Place quartz deposit completed. I mean, I might as well go ahead and place all four of them. These cost 2,000, no, 4,000 this one. Would be the one four? Yeah, these go up in price, 2,000 each time you get one. So now we need to collect some gems. Now that you have a gem deposit, your sim can collect gems and unlock prizes to design a day spa in Simtown. Have a sim collect quartz from a quartz deposit. Click on a quartz deposit, collect 50 quartz for 10 seconds. So this is what the quartz looks like. If you took part in the romance update, you will be very familiar with this style of event where we collected the bananas and the dragon fruit and all those things. This time we just have gems instead of fruit. A little tip is whilst that sim is collecting the quartz, get your other sims using all of the, um, all of the quartz things. So you'll get that little bit extra quartz. Let's go ahead and click that once he is done. And we should get 50 quartz going into our infantry. There we go, task complete, collect some gems. So here we get our progress bar now. So we have unlocked spa robes. Prepare for a day of manicures, massages and saunas by wrapping your sims in a set of spa robes. So these cost 50 gems, let's go ahead and purchase them. You want to unlock? Yes, we do. Congratulations, you have earned the spa robes. Wrap your sims in them for a day at the spa by using any wardrobe or when creating a sim. Now, the next thing you need to do is to use a coin flower patch. Constructor coins are needed. So we're gonna, we've got constructor coins again, like we did with the romance update. Are needed to get items for your spa in this event. The best place to earn them is with a coin flower patch. Find one in the events items tab of the home store and plant a spin flower on it. So back into our home store, event items and a coin flower patch. Place that down and we'll click on it. Free spin we get first off. And let's play that, see what we're going to win. Oh, we got 10 constructor coins with that. We can play a game if we want, either for LPs or with gems, but we're not going to right now. Task complete, use a coin flower patch. The next thing that we need to do is to check the community progress. Everyone collecting gems automatically helps unlock more prizes together. Go to the event screen and tap the third tab to see the combined Sims Free Play Global Communities progress. So this is something that everybody seems to get confused with, with the romance update. So click up on your event progress button here up on the top left hand side and everyone seemed to get confused with the community progress in the sense that they, they thought that they needed their friends to be a part of it and they, if they didn't have any neighbours and things, it is nothing to do with that, it is the whole global community of people who play Sims Free Play, that is what it takes into account. So. Yeah, here we go, global community progress, Yeah, it's not your personal friends, it is every single person playing the Sims Free Play that this bar will go up to and I, I think with the romance update we kind of just managed it within the 12 days. I think that is kind of what will happen 
don't panic about the community progress. I think it will take the 12 days. I think they set it in a certain way that just keep us playing the game for 12 days. These are the prizes that we can win. We can win some open entrances, some clear reflections, steam showers, bathroom maps, and towel wraps are the last ones. So we have checked the community progress tab. The next thing that we need to do is to complete the daily goals. You can earn extra rewards to help you in this event by completing daily goals. So this is a new thing we haven't had before. Go to the daily goals tab of the event screen and complete your first set. You might see that a lot are already done. Let's go into our daily goal, which is the tick one. So collect any gem. We've done that so we can claim a constructor coin. We just spin plant. We've got a constructor coin. Win 10 coins from a coin flower patch where we get 400 quarts claim or buy a prize so there we go so we've got a few different goals that we can do each day i like that idea collect a thousand gems complete all daily goals free quarts or return in like four hours to get free quarts return in 24 hours to get free constructor coins okay i like that so the options for quartz is collect 315 quartz for 3 hours 30 minutes, collect 370 quartz, 5 hours 30, collect 405 quartz, 5, 7 hours 30, and collect 430 quartz, 9 hours 30. Well, you're better to do the shorter one, aren't you, I think? 3 hours and 30 minutes collecting the quartz. So we'll collect these little bonus quartz that we did at the very start, and we'll collect, get everyone set to... Collecting some more, 3 hours and 30 minutes. To speed up or finish off this collection, we use SP instead of LP like we did in the Romance update. If you do want to use SP to speed things up, don't forget that you can use the Social Point flower. It costs 5 LPs to plant that flower and you've got a chance of winning some SPs. Oh, is this going to be? Oh, oh, there we go. I got 12 SP there. So you can collect some SP if you've got a few LP to spare, you can try and do do that. But whilst your sims are collecting the quartz, there will be some bonus quartz that pops up. It's about, I don't know, maybe it's like one every 90 seconds or so that you might get. I'm not entirely sure on the rate that you get it, but I would say if you just check back every hour or so into the game, these events are absolutely something that you have to be playing in Sims. We play quite a lot to be able to complete it, I think. If you check back into the game every hour and just collect your bonus quartz and every three and a half hours come back and set the whole collecting quartz going again, you should be fine. I have completed, collect a thousand gems. We have collected that, so let's go ahead and claim. And we have completed all the daily goals so we can claim our 25 constructor coins. And that will be task complete, complete the daily goals. Now we need to collect bonuses. To collect gems faster, check in regularly and tap the gems floating above your sim's head for a bonus, which is what we've just talked about. Have a sim collect gems from any gem deposit, then wait a few minutes. When you see the gem icon above their head, tap it. So we have just got the gem icon above their heads here, so let's go ahead and tap, and that is task complete, collect bonuses. Now we need to continue collecting gems. Well done. Collect gems to unlock more day spa prize packs and automatically contribute to the global community's progress for additional prizes. Have Sims collect gems to get all the prizes. Spa season ends in 11 days and 15 hours. Obviously that will change depending on when you get to that particular task. Let's just go into our... Oh, we have won something, have we? Oh, congratulations. You've won three constructor coins. Congratulations, you've unlocked the garnet deposits. Garnets will help unlock future prizes. Find the garnet deposits in the event items tab of the home store and start collecting. Spa rugs. So we can... Can we purchase these spa rugs? Yes. Congratulations, you have earned the designer spa rugs. Find them in the rugs tab of the home store and start decorating a holistic space. We've unlocked the spa rugs. The next thing is the Serenity Rain, so we still need some more gems to collect that one. You've just got to keep collecting gems. It's got all the requirements that you need for each particular thing it has got next to it. So the hot springs, as you can see, we need different gems for that. We will need some of the garnets. We've got a mud bath, manicure station, foot spa, mud mask chair, meditation area, massage table, sauna supreme, 
spa resort template a fully designed spa resort template from the sims replay team to build on any home lot ah okay so that's kind of the overall prize let's just go ahead and we will place down the garnet deposit so this costs five thousand to place this down seven thousand for the next one ten thousand for the next one and twelve and a half thousand for the next one let's see what the options are for garnet so 475 in 3 hours 30, 550 in 530, 600 in 730, 650 in 930. So again, you're going to be best off to do the shorter times with these if you can check in regularly into the game. Obviously, if you're not going to be able to check in for 9 hours or something, whether you're at work or school, then obviously do the longer versions to get more of the gems. Let's take a quick look at the prizes we've won so far. So we've got some new slippers. Six different colour new slippers and outfits six different or when you change the outfits you get the matching slippers that go with it so we've got the robes there I'm gonna go with a yellow robe I think and the male adult sims just have the same same robes same colours I'm gonna go with this minty green they are available for seniors as well oh they're also available for teen which I wasn't expecting also available for preteens. Oh my goodness, so wasn't expecting that. You can collect the gems, it seems, with adults and seniors. I don't think anybody else can actually collect any of the gems. Let's take a quick look at the rugs that we won. Oh, so many new rugs. Let's place a few down. So the first one of all the rugs is free. We've got three, six, nine, twelve different rugs. The first one is free, and then they're either one and a half thousand or two thousand for the flowery ones. And look at them. Oh, I love them. Circular rugs. Wow, look at those. And the flower ones. I'm going to continue collecting my gems. Let me know down in the comments what you think of this event. I quite like this style of event. I know a lot of people didn't like it with the romance update, but I do quite like it. There are loads of prizes that we can unlock. You've just got to make sure that you've always got your sims collecting the gems and it is one of those things where you're going to have to check in with the game quite regularly in order to be able to win everything but if you can't win everything just you know keep going as much as you can with it and you can still win some of the prizes even if on the personal progress even if you don't get to the end of the bar that's fine you will get some of the items and I'm pretty sure that we will reach the global community progress we will get all the way to the end so don't panic about that whatsoever like I said before it's not your personal friend it is everybody who plays sims and, and we will get there they're not going to design these things and not allow us to win them in my opinion I might be wrong they might surprise us but that's just what I think of it there you go guys that completes a first little walk so I will probably do another video when I'm further on within this event but thank you so much for watching this video go ahead and thumbs up if you enjoyed subscribe if you're new and i'll see you guys soon for a new video thanks for watching bye